Okay, so um, we're going to be demoing the, uh, the browser here on the Droid. Um, as you can see, really nice high resolution screen. The browser actually is really quick. You'll find that not only on the high resolution screen, but because it is 3.7 inches, you'll see that you get mostly the full web page on here, and it's kind of easy to read already. But you can double tap anywhere to kind of zoom in. Really neat experience there. Double tap to zoom back out. You can see you find the full web page. If you do get it in mobile view, you'll find that um, you can switch to full desktop view. Most of the websites do show it up on the bottom. But as you can see here, that's full desktop view, easily readable. So we're actually in the dock here that Motorola has created. It's a separate accessory. But as you can see, it brings forward the, the five most important things that you would kind of do when you're in the, the car. Um, not only will you be able to perform a voice search, you could say something like navigate to, uh, and then you would say the address, but, but you'll also be able to access your contacts and perform a search from this screen. So, for example, I could go navigate. Navigate to one Verizon Way, Aspen Ridge, New Jersey. It'll perform the search, and then you could just hit go, and it'll bring you right to the navigation application. And you'll find full integration of not only Google Maps, but also views such as satellite views and a, f a bunch of cool layers like restaurants. For example, I'll switch to satellite view here. And as you are driving, you'll find that it does zoom in into the street view. So then, uh, you know, as you get close to your, your turn here, you'll find that it goes in a lot closer. So I'll just show you similar to what it would look like. Um, as you're getting close, you can see there that it does give you a closer view so that you don't make a mistake in terms of where you're navigating to. I'll just hit back there. You'll also see um, on the navigation page you can apply layers such as restaurants and gas stations. So for example if you're in an area where you don't know where you are and you need some gas, um, you apply the gas layer here and it'll actually pinpoint a few locations um, that have gas within the area. You just go ahead and click on one and your route will recalculate to that specific area. So as you can see, it'll recalculate to the specific area, and then from wherever you are, perform that navigation search.